Hi, my name is Toby and welcome to my channel. I'm a real estate advisor in London, but today we're doing something a little different. We're 30 minutes outside of the city touring this incredible property in Beaconsfield, Buckinghamshire. Now this home features six bedrooms, seven bathrooms and has 10,700 square feet of space. It's currently on the market for £5,695,000. For more information on this property, we'll have it in the description down below. Just before we get into this tour, I'd like to thank Heaton from McLaren Specter for allowing me to tour this incredible home. Ready? Let's go. Hey guys, we start off here in the front entrance of the property. Now you have a secure gated driveway, which leads you to the front, parking for numerous vehicles. Just around here, we got the triple garage, which is amazing. Automatic doors, and then your light fixtures on the outside, which are also automatic. Coming around to the front entrance, we got this Georgian style property, which is beautifully done. Steps leading up to the front door. And then to my right, you have a staircase leading down to the mud room, which we'll see later in the tour. Let's head up. Coming through the front door, we're first greeted in the entryway. Now this is a great space for welcoming guests. You have your porcelain tiles, which runs all throughout the space, full height ceilings, and then just in front of me, you have two seating areas. Now my left will make our way into the study. Coming through a great space for if you're working from home, beautifully dressed, home office set up. You could just sit down here and you really feel like the king of your castle. Now, let's make our way out of the study into the first reception room. Coming round, we head into the first reception room. This is your formal reception room. Dress beautifully once again. You have three seating areas, full height ceilings with LED downlights, and then three doors with access points to the garden. Now, of course, you also have your double chandeliers and then a gas fireplace just in front of me, which sets the place off very nicely. Now, let's make our way into the open plan kitchen and reception room. Just around the corner, you come in. This is where most of the entertaining is gonna be happening with friends and family. It flows out of this door into the garden, which we'll see later on. Coming round in front of me, we have the chef's kitchen, one of my favorite parts of this home. You have a large marble island with a nautical blue finish. You have your cooker taps in the stainless steel, as well as the hardware. On my left, we got your large American style fridge and freezer down below. And then coming round to this side of the kitchen, we have your integrated melee appliances, tons of storage below for all of your food, melee induction hob with your recessed vent above and then also the LED downlights. Coming around, it flows through to another melee oven and then of course your melee coffee machine with an espresso maker. On this side, we have your informal dining area, seating for four at this table and then your breakfast nook, which is great for the mornings. Now, let's head into the formal dining area. Coming into the formal dining room, a glorious space. We have seating for eight at this table, dressed very well. You have two doors behind me with access to the gardens. And then of course, your double chandeliers to set the room off nicely. Now this is where the fine dining will be happening with all your friends and family. Now let's make our way back in to the entryway because there are two key features here which I'd like to point out. Firstly, you have this grand staircase which is finished in a marble and then also your brass handrail which runs all along the staircase. If you're not too keen on taking the stairs, this home also has an elevator service with access to every floor. Now you've seen the ground floor, 
Let's head up to the first floor where the magic continues. Follow me. Coming up to the first floor where we have the bedroom suites, we'll start off in the primary bedroom, just through here. We're led through the double doors. You have a king size bed set up, two bedside tables, full height ceilings with LED down lights. You also have the cornicing details and then your integrated surround sound, which runs all throughout the home. Opposite the bed, we have your built-in wardrobes. Tons of space in here for you to store all of your clothes. Coming around, you have your integrated TV unit set up with additional storage above. And if this wasn't enough wardrobe space for you, Follow me just through here, where we have your walk-in wardrobe. I mean, just look at this space. An amazing amount of space for you to continuously store all of your clothes. Now, as we come round, we're led into the ensuite bathroom. We have your marble tiles on the floor and then also on the walls. Double vanities with this metallic finished sink and then your stainless steel hardware. Just above, you have this large mirror with an LED light strip. Coming round, we have your freestanding marble bathtub and then your stainless steel tap. On this side, we have a walk-in shower covered in marble. You have your recessed stainless steel rainfall head. And then just behind me, this heated towel rack to finish off the space. Now let's head into the second bedroom suite. Follow me. Coming in through the double doors, we're led into the second bedroom suite. You have a generous amount of space in here. The property is not fully dressed, but you can imagine this could easily fit a king size bed. You have two bedside tables already set up. And then on this side, you have your built-ins with the wardrobes, which run from the floor to the ceiling. Tons of space in here for you to store all of your clothes. Now let's make our way into the ensuite bathroom. We have these dark toned tiles on the floor and then also on the walls, a large vanity which is great, your stainless steel hardware, and then you have this LED backlit mirror. Opposite the vanity is your walk-in shower. This is a great design right here. You have the glass balustrade on my left, dark tone marble tiles, and then this floating stainless steel rain forehead, which is a great touch. Now on the sides of the shower, you have these LED light strips, which is really slick, sets the tone and the vibe off in this space really nicely. Now let's make our way into the third bedroom. Follow me. Just before we do, one key feature to point out is your bespoke chrome handles, which you'll see on all the doors of this property. Coming around into the third bedroom suite. Now we're first met with this nice sitting area just in front of us, which is a great separation for the bedrooms. We'll make our way into the third bedroom suite. Once again, can it easily fit a king size bed. You have your bedside table set up. On this side, you have your built-in wardrobes which run wall to wall. Tons of space in here. Now it flows into the ensuite bathroom. And here you have the lighter tone tiles on the floors and also on the walls. This spa style bathtub, which is really great. And then in front of that, we have your walk-in shower with stainless steel rain forehead. Coming round, you got your floating marble vanity, stainless steel taps, and then your recessed mirror with LED spotlights. And the space is also finished off with your floating toilet, which is great. Let's make our way now into the fourth bedroom, which mimics this first third bedroom. Coming through into the fourth bedroom, have enough space here for your king size bed with two bedside tables already set up. To my left, we have your water wall built-in wardrobes with a ton of space in here 
to store all of your clothes. It flows into the ensuite bathroom. We have marble tiles on the floors and then also on the walls. Floating vanity on that side. And over here we have your walk-in shower with a stainless steel rainfall head and then your recessed soap box with LED spotlights, which is a really nice touch. On this side, we also have your heated towel rack to finish off the space. Now let's head up to the final floor where we'll see the remaining two bedroom suites. Follow me. Coming up the staircase, we have these light fixtures also, which is another great installation throughout the home. We're led into the fifth bedroom through these double doors. You have a generous amount of space in here. Two large windows with north facing views over the gardens, full height ceilings with LED downlight, and then your fitted carpets. Through here, we have the walk-in wardrobe with a bunch of storage here for all of your clothes. It leads to the ensuite bathroom. And here we have the porcelain tiles on the floor, also on the walls, heated towel rack, a walk-in shower with stainless steel finish. And on this side, you have this floating vanity, a marble countertop, and then this nautical blue that we saw from the kitchen below as a cabinetry and then a large mirror. Now let's head into the final bedroom. We're led into the sixth bedroom. Generous amount of space in here once again. Fitted carpets, full height ceilings. You have three windows in this bedroom. And then just through here, you have your walk-in wardrobe, which also features a skylight, which I love. Now let's head into the ensuite bathroom just around here. Lighter tones in here. You have this really large jacuzzi style bathtub, stainless steel finishes on the hardware, your floating vanity, and this really nice rectangular mirror with your LED light strip surrounding. Now follow me to the lower ground floor where we're gonna see the entertainment space of this home. We're gonna take the elevator downstairs this time. Here we are on the lower ground floor. We'll start off in the home cinema. Coming through, an amazing space. On my left here, we have your wet bar with a marble countertop. You have your stainless steel finishes. And then one of my favorite touches, your automatic push to touch cabinetry doors. Not too shabby. And then touch again to close. Now we'll make our way into the main portion of the home cinema. You have dark tones on the carpet and then also on the walls. Your vaulted ceilings with LED light strips surrounding and then of course your surround sound. Now a home cinema wouldn't be a home cinema without these cool gadgets and toys. We just press one simple button here. And there you go. Lights dim automatically and your movie plays. Now, let's make our way into the indoor swimming pool. Coming through these doors, we're led into the indoor swimming pool. We make our way down these steps, an amazing space. You have 13 meter long swimming pool, which runs all along this room. You have your integrated spa on my left, which is great. On the opposite side, of the swimming pool. You have your jacuzzi, the seating for 10, and then a sitting area right here, which is really nice. Now, the space isn't finished off just yet, as just around the corner, we have your dedicated home gym. The equipment isn't set up just yet, but you have your fitted rubber floors. Now we'll make our way through the door where you have this amazing spiral staircase which leads us back to the ground floor. We'll head upstairs or we'll give an overall summary. 
So there you have it, Tahila. Overall, six immaculate bedrooms, seven bathrooms, and an amazing entertainment space. Thanks once again to Heaton from McLaren Spectre for allowing us to tour this incredible home. If you have any questions or comments, drop them down below. If you'd like to see more, make sure to hit subscribe and like. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.